I just got really discouraged from posting on Instagram. Alright guys, so I made it. Today it's at 30,000 views. Hey guys, welcome to a new weekend vlog. So it's been like a week since I've picked up the camera to vlog. I've just been working and just doing a few different things, but I am back with a new weekend vlog. We're doing some fun things this weekend. I just got a notification that some of my Amazon packages got delivered. So I'm gonna go downstairs and get them and show you guys what I got. And I um, just washed and straightened my hair. So I'm about to put my clippings back in and do my hair. I think I'm gonna do a little makeup and make some content today for my TikTok and probably just take a cute little pic to post on my story or something on Instagram. I wanna catch you guys up on something really exciting. So um, let me go grab my other phone and then I will be back. I just wanted to show you guys, I've been making content on Instagram and I feel like I probably mentioned before in a vlog that I just got really discouraged from posting on Instagram because I wasn't really getting, I wasn't really, nobody's really showing me, ain't showing me any love and like when I first started posting reels on Instagram, I was like losing a lot of followers. I was like literally equally losing the same amount of followers I was gaining so I stayed stagnant for a while and so I told myself I was like I'm not posting on Instagram anymore, like I'm over it and so one day i was just like you know what okay i'm gonna post on instagram i'm gonna post this reel like who cares if no one likes it i'm just gonna do it like i took the time to create this video edit it i'm gonna post it whatever i posted it and the reel um i hate saying went viral because i feel like it's such a corny term but it um it definitely did some good it got a, I'm trying to figure out like how to word this. Um, it got a good amount of views. So this video got like 5,000 likes, 171 shares. Um, and it actually is at like 29,000 views today. And this video got me like a couple hundred followers on IG. So that really gave me like a spark of motivation um, to keep going. And like, I don't know, it just made me really motivated so i posted like a few other vlogs after or not vlogs but oh yeah a few other like mini vlogs after that you know they did okay nothing crazy then i decided let me just do a get ready with me for work i know that people have kind of like those videos videos in the past so let me just try it out yeah i posted this a week ago and today it just hit 31k the crazy thing is this video just really started going crazy on monday monday it hit like 7k today is friday and today it's at 30,000 views like it literally got like 5,000 views yesterday so it went from like 19k yesterday up to or no it was at 11k um on thursday then it jumped to 19k on friday or wait no, no i'm tripping wednesday it was at like 11k on wednesday thursday it hit 19k and then today friday it hit 30k and this video has also gotten me a couple hundred followers so when i first started out posting content like inconsistently on youtube or on um ig i was at like 3600 followers and i'm today i am at 5611 followers monday i was at like 40 today is friday monday i was at 4700 followers today i'm at 5600 that means i gained 900 followers on instagram in a week that is a big deal and also like i've been getting you know some comments here and there and stuff like messages from girls like hey where'd you get this where'd you get that so i need to get that amazon partner program partner thing link together so i can start getting some coins for sharing these links with these girlies but y'all it just it it makes me feel really good and i just know that this is the right this is the, st the right step in the right direction towards getting my brand more recognition um because i'm dropping some new things in may i think i mentioned that before and i just want the girlies to support and shop my brand so that i can get bigger and better like i've said it before i don't care about the whole clout thing or like being an influencer i don't think i'm influencing anything i just want people to shop my brand okay and i want to start a new business and i want people to shop that business too so um it just it gets me it's, it's getting me really excited because a lot of girls are following me and you know i'm trying to just build myself up because it's like working with influencers like other influencers it's so hard you can pay them they might not post you know what i'm saying they're so slow responding they don't really care i need to be my own promoter for my brand okay like i need my own supporters and followers you know what i'm saying like yeah 
So that's what I'm trying to build up myself so I can just promote my brand. It's all about my business, I promise you. Like, I just want customers, okay? I don't care about none of that other stuff. So um, I've got some exciting things this weekend. I got invited to, if you guys are familiar with Moon Cosmetics, um, it's an Atlanta-based, Black-owned, woman-owned brand. And um, she started her brand six years ago, her business, her skincare line, um, six years ago. And if anyone remembers, like, Jada and Ari were, like, heavily promoting her mask it was like a, i want to say it was a turmeric mask but i can't remember 100 percent um her her face mask and like some oil that she had they were promoting it heavy she made like a million dollars in 24 hours so she did a rebrand um and now she's back and she's doing a relaunch on sunday so i got invited to that she came across my profile for my content and i got invited which is so exciting so um, i wanted to order a dress for the event but didn't happen so i'm just gonna have to wear something that i have but i'm just so excited to go to have been invited to like a brand like launch party and they're doing like a red carpet and then something called activations i don't really know what that means but um i'm just really excited and i'm honored that i got invited so going to that on sunday that'll be fun um i'm about to feel like i said i'm getting ready to film some content but i'm about to go downstairs and get my packages and yeah i'm just it's gonna be a nice great productive weekend I'm getting my nieces on Saturday tomorrow, which is gonna be a lot of work. I'm probably not gonna vlog while I have them because they're crazy. I might vlog a little bit, but I'm gonna be stressed out. So I'm not gonna vlog too much, but yeah, I'm just really excited for the month of May. I've already got all my content planned for May. I need to start planning, doing stuff for my business plan, business planning that's next up that I need to do. So I'll probably do that this weekend. Um, Sorry, there's somebody on their porch and I just feel like we're going to lock in and make eye contact in a second. But anyways, um, I'm getting a chemical peel this month. I'm going to start doing laser hair removal, so I'll take you guys through those processes. Yeah, this guy's staring at me. It's so awkward. Um, and what else am I doing this month? I'm getting knotless braids. I'm going to let these fall out and then I'm going to get decurl because I just don't like it. And I'm so excited to get my chemical peel because my skin has been like crazy and i think i'm just gonna start doing monthly facials because i'm trying to invest in my looks okay i'm trying to keep myself together so i'll show you guys the chemical pill process that'll be another vlog um that appointment is on the 8th so it's not this coming monday because this coming monday is the first yeah i'm just really excited to show you guys everything and just all the progress i've been making i'm just so happy and motivated and um i'm just i'm really happy so there's just a lot of good things that are coming in man i'm really excited but yeah let me go downstairs get my packages and show you guys what's up it's like wow i know dobermans are so cute they're such good dogs and i don't hear anything like that and it's like it's like you know like it's like you know 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 All right, let's see these cups. Oh my god, I'm so excited to use my vacuum. Hey guys, so I'm on FaceTime with my sister, but she's doing her virtual teaching, so she's not gonna pay attention to me. Um, oh my god. So these are my cups. I don't know what this is for. Oh my goodness. These are so cute. I'm gonna get a little bit closer so that you guys can see. So these are the cups that I got from Amazon, super cute. And then the straw, cute. Okay, and then they also came with um, this type of straw as well. So that's so cute. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. Oh, I'm so excited to make content today. I gotta wash this stuff first. And then it also did come with a straw brush so that you can like clean the inside of the straws real good. So I'm super excited to make, um, I'm gonna be making pink drinks in these and iced coffee. And then I might get into matcha too. I didn't realize that these are so small, but it's still cute nonetheless. But I'm so happy that everything came early. I thought this stuff was gonna come till it said it was gonna come till 10 p.m. So I'm gonna go ahead and make my heart shaped eggs. I'm actually gonna just go this away. Oh, 
helping you? Because I ordered um, one of these for like, well, my mom, she got it for me, um, to make the little like ice balls, but I probably won't get it till like Sunday or Monday, so. I'm gonna go ahead and get my clothes Alright, so there's that. Um, oh my, I'm so excited. I'm gonna make a few videos today. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, cool. And also, I'm gonna show you guys um, this is just a lint roller. This is not anything exciting. Lint roller, desperately needed this though. And then I got this vacuum. I'm so excited to use my to vacuum so bad in here. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and clean these and just do my, um, my hair real quick and then I'm gonna do some content. All right, hey guys, so I just finished with my hair. I decided to do um, a little half up, half down situation. And it came out really good. So I'm about to lay my edges. Um, you can definitely tell that my rinse is starting to rinse out because my brown hair is starting to make a comeback. So I think I might get another, um, box of rinse and probably dye my hair back black before I get my braids because I think I want to do braids like black braids instead of like my color four hair because I'm getting Alice braids on the 12th I think the 15th so yeah but I'm gonna have to look in the mirror for this because I want to make sure that my edges look good um I'm gonna put y'all like right here. But I gotta make sure my edges look good. Okay. Okay. So I'm trying to think like what kind of situation I want here. Like, am I gonna do two side? Am I gonna do like a. What am I gonna do? Let's see. And I think that's enough. There. Well, maybe it's a little bit more right here. This is my new vacuum that I got from Amazon. It was $60. Hey guys, so I'm just popping in really quickly. I'm actually editing this video and it's still in the process of being filmed. But I just wanted to pop in and let you guys know that for some reason I lost my footage getting ready for the Moon X Cosmetics event, going, being there all that but if you are interested in seeing that i did make a video on my tiktok and my instagram page showing um the full event myself included which is really cool so if you want to see that video you can check it out on instagram see that there what you're about to currently see is current day and the footage before i did not want to delete it even though I don't have, you know, all the footage. I really didn't want to delete it because I took the time to record it. So I'm just going to combine that weekend with this weekend. That video that I was talking about on Instagram that was at like 30,000 views. It's at 80,000 views now. That reel that I posted. And I'm currently at like 7,300 followers on Instagram. So I've been making some progress and I'm happy. I actually didn't post any content on my TikTok or my Instagram at all this week because literally just yesterday, Friday, I got my hair done and I got my lashes and my eyebrows done and I was just not really feeling recording um, while I had like a few lashes on each eye. My eyebrows were overgrown. My hair looks good because I still have my clippings in but I just wasn't feeling it and I didn't take the time to plan content so I didn't want to rush and post anything. So yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys that but back to the vlog. So today is Friday the 17th. I'm currently on the way to get my lashes done. I'm going to get a full set and I'm going to be trying D-curl for the first time ever because C-curl just really hasn't been my thing. I just feel like that I want them to have a little bit of curl. So I'm going to get my lashes done in Sandy Springs. I just picked up my sister's car, by her car, because um, usually I just kind of like Uber around. But 
Ubering to appointments that are on two different sides of the city. And living in the city is just too much. So I'm headed to Zay's going to get my lashes done. And after that, I'm getting my hair braided on the south side of town. And I'm going to be getting knotless braids. And I haven't really asked anyone if I could vlog. So I don't know if I'm going to actually vlog like during the appointments. But I will check in with you guys obviously afterwards so you can see. And then tomorrow, oh, I don't see clothes. This girl over here is trying to race and I really just don't have time. She's all up in my face. She wants to be on my team so bad. She's getting on my It's like, girl, get from behind me. I'm not speeding up for you, babe. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So anyways, guys, like I was saying. Okay, so tomorrow I'm supposed to be filming with this guy. And he wants me to do, like, memorize this script or whatever for YouTube. So we're doing that. It's kind of like some kind of like couple skit. I don't know. So we're gonna do the couple skit, and I'm just happy that I'll have my lashes and my hair done because that's that's what I need. <laughs> that's what I need for creating content. It has to be a look. Okay, guys. So I just got my lashes done. I got D curl short. I don't know what length she used. I got D curl short cat eye. You obviously can't really see them yet, so I'm gonna show you my lashes for real, for real, like once I get my hair done and I can hop out. But right now I'm heading to my hair appointment. So yeah, I will check in with you guys. Maybe while I'm getting my hair done, because um, the girl that does my hair, she's really cool. The girl who does my lashes is cool too, but it's more so like a, you know, one-on-one, -on -one, let's catch up, let's chat. And it's not necessarily tea that is meant to be shared with YouTube. So I might show you a little something, but if not, you'll definitely see my braids afterwards. And then we've got all weekend to hang out and chat. So yeah, I will talk to you guys very soon. Okay, and also while I'm at this red light, I just wanted to say, I thought it was so cute today that my lash artist, she was like, I'm gonna ask you for advice because I just feel like you're very level-headed and you know, I value your opinion. And I just thought that was so, I mean, she didn't really say that verbatim, but she, she said that in so many words. So I just thought that was so cute that like, she thinks that of me. I think that's really cute, so yeah. I just want to share that with you guys. All right, y'all. So I forgot that I needed to get some extra cash. So I just stopped at the bank um, to get some cash before my hair appointment. Because before I had only gotten enough. I forgot I had only gotten enough out for my lash appointment. Because I really just do not like carrying like a whole bunch of cash. It's just not my thing. I had to lock my doors too. Not my thing. So I just got my cash and um, I'm by my house. So I figured I might as well go upstairs and use the bathroom because I have to pee so bad. I'm gonna go upstairs, use the bathroom. Oh, okay, well, I'm over here. I should get my eyebrows done. And then I can just use the bathroom in there. But also, the point of me going home was so that I could eat. Cause I'm on a budget, I'm not trying to eat out too much because for my sister's birthday dinner, which is gonna be probably this weekend or Monday, which is her actual birthday. Girl, I was done. We're supposed to be going to Nobu. Now, why would you do that? Why would you do that? Oh, I'm sorry y'all, my mouth is out of control. So yeah, we're going to Nobu. So I'm trying to save my coins for Nobu. And um, I guess I will park, oh, I can park over there. Okay, so I'm trying to save my coins. That's basically what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to save my money. So, but yeah, I really do need my eyebrows done. So I'm about to do that so I can look really good after I get my hair done. And I wanted to create content tomorrow morning. And also too, while I have my sister's car, I might as well just go ahead and get my eyebrows done. So that way, if I'm gonna, if I'm fully, you know, put together, I can go ahead and make my content first thing in the morning before I go meet with that guy. So yeah, let's go get our eyebrows done. Let's go. Then I guess when I go in there, I'll probably just like flip my hat up. Yeah, I guess that'll work.
All right, y'all, so I'm gonna go up here and get my eyebrows done and hopefully there's not a bunch of girlies in there. It's not like crazy with my hat. If there's a whole bunch of people in there, I'm turning around. I'm not gonna get my eyebrows done. But if there's nobody in there, I'm not gonna care about flipping my hat up and looking crazy. And the way she's standing up here, probably isn't nobody up here, so let's see. are in here looking good with their hair done and I will look like this but I'm already in here so I have to play your brows done. Embarrassing. That's why I never being outside like this. Sorry my eyes were tearing up so I was using my fan but I'm not gonna use it while I'm recording because I know the noise will probably be annoying but I just got my eyebrows done. When I went in there I actually ended up just putting my hair in a bun and tying my head wrap that I have under here around my edges and the girls were staring at me when I came out of the bathroom like mind your business. But yeah so it's 139 my appointment's at 230 and i want to say it's probably like 40 it might be a 45 minute drive with traffic so i do need to hurry up and get on the road but i kind of want to go to my house and like put on some hydrocortisone cream on my eyebrows because i feel like they're gonna break out and i don't want to be filming tomorrow i gotta come out of here real slow because people be driving here through here too quick but what I was saying was, I want to go home and just, like, I don't have time to really make anything to eat. So I think I might just, oof, goodness. I'll be driving through here too fast. Like, I'm not expecting people to come out of parking spaces. But anyways, I'm talking too much. So, as I was saying, I'm not going to really be able to make myself anything to eat. So I think I'm just going to make another protein shake to go. And then I'm gonna put some hydrocortisone cream on my eyebrows because I feel like they're gonna break out because they always do. But last time I got my eyebrows down, I put hydrocortisone cream on them every single day and they didn't break out. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that because like I was saying, I'm filming tomorrow with that content creator and I don't wanna be in nobody's video looking crazy. So I'm gonna go home and do that. And then tonight when I get home, I'll probably do a face mask. I was supposed to get my chemical pill a week ago or i'm sorry i was supposed to get my chemical pill at the beginning of the month the appointment got canceled because the girl supposedly got into a car accident so i'm still out here struggling and i really need a facial so bad like the texture of my skin right now is just not it so i'm hoping in june with my new job and then me still being able to do my current job remotely once i have like that extra income i'll definitely be able to do my peel which is going to be crazy because i'm going to be training for my new job my face is gonna be peeling off people are probably gonna be like what the heck but i gotta do it hey guys so i am home and as you can see my hair is braided let me try to see if i can show you guys like the whole shebang here okay so these are my braids let me pull this down super cute and they lay super flat. I get my braids done by Hair by TT. I love her so much. She is just great, great conversation. She's quick and she always just does such a great job. I'm gonna show you guys, this is her page. Um, Hair by TT with two underscores. Love her, she's great. I just got out the shower. I'm about to do some skincare. So first things first, I'm just gonna go over my face with a baby wipe because it's so oily. And earlier I had put, y'all saw, well you guys didn't see, but earlier I did come home right before my appointment and I put on some hydrocortisone cream on my eyebrows. So I'm gonna do that again, but I'm gonna do that again, but um, I wanna first like cleanse my face. Cause whew. I know my skin is so oily. But yeah, I'm loving this decurl for sure. Like, loving it, loving it, loving it. And then also, too, I need to pull out some extra baby hairs because it just don't ever be enough for me. But I don't, I don't really ever tell her to like take them out because I don't want it to be too much. I just feel like I know like the right amount. So I'm about to do that really quickly, too. I'm so tired because I feel like a zombie and after I do all this, I still have to call my sister with her paper. Okay, so let's see. Okay. 
Let's see how, how this looks. Okay, so now um, I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse my face and just like whoo, brush my teeth, all that good stuff. I wanna use my Moon X Cosmetics stuff, but I do not want to use the toner that I mean, the cleanser that kind of like stained my nails. I think it was this one, the super cleanser. Yeah, this, I love this so much, but it will legit stain your nails and stuff. So, I don't really care too much about this. I'm gonna use this rag and this washcloth. And I'm gonna just put it on here. Cause last time it stained my nails. But I just finished washing my face. I'm gonna go ahead and apply the glow toner. Now I'm gonna go in with their moisturizer. And I'm gonna use this one, the Hydra Moisturizer. And that's it. And then I'm gonna brush my teeth, which I'm gonna do off camera because I don't want y'all. I just need to brush my teeth. But I have this, I don't think I've shown y'all yet. If you follow me on TikTok and Instagram, then you've seen it, but I have this super cute pink toothbrush that I use, still it from this morning. And then um, afterwards, of course, I floss. And then I use my TheraBreath mouthwash. So yeah, I'm gonna do that and then um, I'll come back and say goodnight. Hi right, guys, so I'm back with a fresh face and fresh breath. Um, I'm saying goodnight to you guys, but I am gonna quickly help my sister with her paper. Um, and then I will see you guys tomorrow when we get ready for the content that we're making tomorrow. And yeah, see my forehead's already breaking out. But yeah, I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow, so good night. Okay, so I just came back to say that I forgot to put my hydrocortisone cortisone cream on, which this is really like a ointment, it's not like a cream. But this is the one that I have. And I've had this for years, I don't even know, this might be expired. But, um, no, it doesn't expire until 2025, period. I like to put that on my eyebrows after I get them done because it keeps my forehead and stuff from breaking out it really does because that it just like that breakout after eating our eyebrows started really lasts a few days and i feel like it takes away from you know what i'm saying the look so i just want to say that really quickly but i really am about to go and i'm going to sleep because i'm so tired so i'll see you guys in the morning hey guys good morning so i'm about to start getting ready for um the skit that i'm doing today for this content creator's youtube channel so I'm just practicing my lines right now. And it's just, I'm literally cracking myself up because I'm not, I'm not an actress. But we're gonna do some acting today. So. I'm about to get ready, but I'm contemplating because I haven't posted anything on Instagram or on Twitter. Well, I'm gonna say Twitter. I haven't posted anything on Instagram or TikTok all week. So I was thinking about making like, a get ready with me to create content but i could do that with y'all and then later on i could do a get ready with me because my sister's birthday dinner is tonight so i could do like a get ready with me for dinner i could certainly do that tonight i just feel so bad for like not posting today or not but not posting this week so yeah i'm probably gonna get ready soon but okay sorry guys my mom's like texting me about my sister's birthday festivities this weekend which i will definitely bring you guys along for that um we're gonna go to this super cute restaurant so i'm excited for that it's called jojo's and it looks really cute inside so i'm really excited for that but i'm just trying to think like what should i wear because I really do not have a lot of clothes. Your girl needs to go shopping. I threw away a lot of stuff when I moved here. So I was like, oh, I'll just get new clothes. And then I started buying stuff for my new apartment and clothes just really never came into consideration. 
so I definitely need to get some new clothes though for sure but until then this is the vibe you know what i have is just what's gonna have to work so i'm still trying to think in my head like what i can wear but we're gonna figure it out and then i already know what i'm wearing for dinner it's just gonna be because i've already worn and but hopefully tonight i can get a cute picture so i can post on instagram but we'll see but yeah i'm about to keep practicing my lines um and basically what this skit is it's just like um i'm gonna tell you what the title of the skit is the title of the skit is when you're used to being in a toxic relationship. So I'm the girlfriend, my name is Brittany, and um, Jay is my boyfriend or whatever. And that's just what it is. So I'm gonna practice my lines and I'm gonna come back and get ready with y'all. And then we're gonna do, we're gonna do, we're gonna go create content. So yeah, we're gonna go do whatever. So yeah, I'll be back y'all. Um, Alright guys, so I made it. I'm in the parking garage and I like literally just took a picture because for some reason I always forget where I park. So I'm about to head up here. If it's not awkward, I'll film. If it is awkward, then I'll talk to you afterwards. So let's go. So I am back home. Um I didn't record because it was like just me and the other guy i thought there was gonna be like maybe like someone else there i don't know so it was it would probably would have been like a little awkward if i tried to vlog so i'm back it was fun um we shot the video for youtube and we also did do um a video for instagram so um if you follow me on instagram you might see me repost that like on my story or something and then finally for the first time today which is terrible because it's like four o'clock finally about to have my first bite of eat today and as you can like hear my voice i'm so drained like that was just a lot and i literally was standing like for three and a half hours um refilming and refilming refilling and getting different angles and things like that so i am tired like i have this uh chicken tiki masala that i just warmed up i added some avocado i'm about to eat that and try to rest for a little bit and then i think i'm gonna clock in and do some work for my job so yeah guys i'm tired definitely need a nap so i'm debating like should i have an iced coffee and just push through and really like you know do my work and then start to edit this vlog or should i try to just rest try to take a nap i think i'm gonna rest and try to take a nap because i'm pooped so yeah I'm going to chat with you guys. And then also, too, my sister ended up canceling her reservation for dinner. So now I'm not going to have, like, a get ready with me for dinner video. So I'm probably just not, I'm probably going to end up not posting any content this weekend. Um, I might post a video, though, that I made for TikTok. So I guess I'll just go ahead and edit that now. Whew. But, yeah, I'm going to catch up with you guys later. Sorry, this is, like, is the most fun weekend. Hey guys, so I'm currently packing up to go to my um, my friend's house, my friend Deja, that I've known for a few years. So I'm just gonna get all my stuff together and then head over there. Her boyfriend's out of town and she's just at home with her baby. So I'm just gonna go spend some time with her, catch up, and um, I will bring you guys over there as well and introduce you to her. I'm just packing up all my skincare stuff right now and I'm just gonna bring it there and do it there because it's late and I don't want her to fall asleep waiting on me to do my whole skincare regime. And I just feel like that's kind of selfish anyway. So I'm just gonna bring everything with me. Take this. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put my hydro cortisone cream. So I'm gonna put that on tonight. I didn't keep the, the cortisone cream on the whole night yesterday. So my eyebrows did a little bit of like irritation did get to come through, but it's not as bad as it usually is, which is good. But I am gonna put it on there again tonight so that no breakout prospers. I don't know if I have gel already in my summer night bag, but if I don't, I mean, it's not a big deal. I'm not going anywhere, so let me see. Yeah, so I'm just bringing my deodorant, my bag of my skincare, my toothbrush, I'm gonna bring my mouthwash and um, this is, I'm gonna put this in here. And then I'm gonna bring my body butter and then I'm putting everything in my, so the night bag. 
This is my spin the night bag. It was a gift. I don't know where it's from. So, sorry guys. It was a gift. Um, and it was a gift from years ago. I've had it for, I want to say like two or three years now. But yeah, I'm about to get dressed. I just have on this cream hoodie that my mom bought me um, last Christmas. And then these pink PacSun sweatpants. Nothing special. I'm about to go ahead and head to my besties house and i've got oil on my scalp too actually because i don't know why but my scalp has just been getting so flaky <laughs> say hey no. wow she's being fake because she's talking about her tea and i cut her off so that she didn't tell her tea to the world and she's being fake but she's making us cookies so wholesome we love that Wow. I really don't like fake people. That's why I don't be coming over here like that. But anyways, y'all, we're about to talk, so. Thank you. Ooh, thank you. Hi. Thank you. So we're currently getting ready for my sister's birthday dinner. Today's her birthday. It is Monday, May 22nd. My skin looks terrible because I'm on my period and I haven't been drinking water. So I'm trying to like make it work. She's getting her wig together. Can you clip this? Look, let me hide the front. Yeah, I really got the flat iron down and put some gum. Ooh, I didn't mean to say that bad word. Put some um, spray on it, like holding spray or whatever. My skin looks so good. Do you want some hydra boost? It's like a primer. No, my skin is very hydrated. It's just the texture. Well, it helps blur pores. It's too late. I'm already putting on my foundation. This dress is from Fashion Nova. I've had it for a few years. So I'm vlogging. What do you expect? Wow, it's my birthday. You're making. You did this during my birthday vlog and you were talking to me and talking so much when I was trying to talk. So anyways, as I was saying, this dress is from Fashion Nova. I've had it for a few years. That's all I was trying to say and I'm gonna be done recording. So you made the reservation for four or for five? Four, 9.15. I can't believe so you're really just gonna leave him here. Hey, Jason, what? You're really just gonna leave him here? He said that he went to just sleep. Oh, okay. Yeah, it wasn't <laughs> yeah, I see something. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> So the last time I spoke to you guys, I believe was either Monday or Tuesday. And today is, today's Friday. Today is Friday. So I'm gonna go ahead and close out the vlog here. I'm gonna do a weekly vlog next week, which is gonna be like the week of Memorial Day, like Memorial Day week. And I've got some exciting things. I start my new job next week, which is really exciting. I already got my work laptop set up, my work email. Submitted all my paperwork, so it's official. Then signed the offer letter, so I'll be starting that. Um, my new job on the 30th, remote, which I'm really excited about. So I need to like order a desk for my house and just like office supplies and all kinds of things, which will be fun to do. So we'll do that, and you'll see that in the coming weeks. And then I also need to do some shopping because now like I'm no longer a scrub girly, I'm a corporate girly, so I need to go get some business like some cute business clothes because like my style is more so like sexy so i don't really have anything that's like business appropriate so 
girl's gonna get some new clothes and shoes. Next weekend, I'm also going to dinner with one of my coworkers from my previous slash current job because I'm still gonna do it part-time. We're gonna go to dinner next week, so that's gonna be really fun. Yeah, just some fun things will be happening next week. I think I'll probably go get my nails redone because these are done for me to get a new set. I'll probably get my lashes refilled. I'll probably resume going back to the gym. I started my period this week, so I was like, eh, not doing it. But that was really the whole purpose of getting braids, like really taking my hair break, but also so I can have a gym friendly hairstyle also to the last time i spoke to you guys i was telling that i was gonna get my teeth whitened let me tell you so before you get your teeth whitened before you do zoom you're supposed to do um sensodyne twice a week or no, I'm, not, I'm sorry not twice a week you're supposed to brush with sensodyne every day um two weeks prior to your appointment i didn't do that so i did all four sessions on high and when i tell you afterwards my teeth were so sensitive and i kept getting these things called zingers which are basically like electrical shocks of sensitivity to your teeth i was at work like like shrieking and excruciating pain and when i opened my mouth to talk in the cold air from the office at my teeth girl i was done so i had to go home and take out a bill pm and just sleep through it and then when I woke up around 10, it, I noticed it wasn't as bad and excruciating um, as it was earlier. And then the next day I was fine. So these are my teeth. After getting them whitened, they look really, really good because they were yellow before. And then I'm going to insert um, the before and after picture right here so that you guys can see. Huge difference. Great results. Um, definitely lifted my teeth, whitened my teeth a few shades. And then I also got some take-home trays. So I'm about to start my at-home whitening and like keep that up for the next two weeks and just kind of do it here and there so I can keep my teeth nice and white and try to get them even wider. And then I think at the end of the year, I'll probably go and get them whitened again because white teeth, like I was filming a vlog a few weeks ago for here and I was like up close to the camera talking and I was just like, dang, my teeth are kind of yellow. So now your girl's talking and she's got a new smile. She's got new teeth, period. But um, no, seriously, I'm, I want to keep it up. I'm loving the white teeth. I'm loving it. So yeah, I'm going to keep that up. And then I'm going to probably be getting my Invisalign soon because my new job got me some new dental insurance. And it's effective June 1st, which is in a few days. So I'm going to set up my consultation for Invisalign because this, everyone always tells me, oh, it's not that bad, it's not that bad. You're right, it's not that bad, and I never said it was, but I want to fix it, so I'm going to. Um, but I think I'm probably going to have to get my wisdom teeth extracted. They're not fully erupted. They're still below the gum line, only really this one you can see, just above it. I don't know, I'm going to have to see once I get my consultation if that needs to be done. So we'll be doing that, and then I'm going to try to schedule for a chemical peel next month because this month didn't work out. So there's a lot of fun things coming in June. June will be nice. July will be great. August will be better. I'm gonna try to get a new car probably come August. That's my goal. I would love to wait it out till Christmas so I can like be like, oh, Christmas gift to myself. But I don't think I, wait. I can wait that long. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, guys, closing up the vlog. I um, love you lots if you made it to the end of this video. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on IG and TikTok. My name is the same on every platform. And I will see you guys very soon.